Welcome to my house of Husker. This is my son Austin and he's pretty much just playing with his uh Yu-Gi-Oh, but just gonna take some pictures of the uh of the home. Kinda got crazy and started framing and putting collectibles all around the house. The ultimate man cage on the main level. One of my uh, pride and joys here is uh, this little 1930s pennant and a little uh, card signed by Dana Bible, who was a coach from 1930 to 36. We try and keep everything uh, before 1975. Everything got mass produced after that time. But also, I was kind of bored in the 60s and 70s, so. I also really like this Bob Devaney poster that I framed. Uh, it says Coach in the Hat. This is my dining area that pretty much gets Legos a lot. A couple frame pictures. That one hasn't been hung up correctly, but there's a cabinet full of. Uh, of uh, assorted, uh, you know, party hats and memorabilia. Kind of a mess right now, as you might see. Now the red Big Ten, I've got some Big Ten pennants framed. This here is an old pillowcase made for the University of Minnesota back in the 1930s. Got a bunch of pennants from different teams. Not a big uh, fan there, but. Uh, Tom Osborne and Bob Vanny stuff. I framed a couple of old uh, newspapers in an old frame. And the 1962 team right there, Team Panoramic. Hard to see, but Bob Devaney's first year. This here is, uh, you know, the kitchen area. Wouldn't be a good kitchen without, you know, having to uh, eat snacks at the little bar and drink some beverages without having your uh, sports really there to kind of gaze at. Kind of have predominantly Husker football on the bottom, but then I kind of have my Yankees and other kind of old sports memorabilia. old carvings that my uh, uncle made. Top above the cabinets I kind of put a, a frame to pin it for each one of the Big Ten schools. And I also have these little these old beer trays or food serving trays with each one of the teams. This is my collection of old vintage pens that don't have them quite uh, framed. My son's uh, fourth grade project that's supposed to be the uh, Nebraska State Capitol. We gotta turn it in this week so it, it's out of focus. The rest of the teams up there. Alrighty, this is how you have an uh, open layout of a 120 year old house with the living room and the kitchen being clustered with vintage Husker memorabilia. Hope you like it. Go Big Red. Hi. Can you say Go Big Red? Go Big Red. Christy, what are you doing? Christy, can you uh, quit chewing on the stuffed animal for a little bit? There's no treats in there. <laughs> See you later.